Hi, welcome to Lucas Learning Channel. You know, yesterday we had chat this natural moving headline, and I have to say it is really good moving headline. It is well built outside, you know, the housing and painting is really high class, I can say that. And uh, you know, uh, it shows the numbers, the letters, and each LED is picture mapping. It is a really super good effect moving headline. And today what we bring is another effect moving headline, you know, it is the rolling moving headline, the big effect. You know, also each LED could be pixel mapping. Its name is the Fantastic Roller. <laughs> yeah, it is really a fantastic name. You know, uh, judge from the outside, I could say that, you know, these two movie headlines is come from one metal factory. I mean the housing, you know, the housing also well built and the arms here is much well, you know, almost the same size. I could say that yeah, it's exactly the same size and the base is exactly the same and the painting is exactly so good. Yeah. I have to say I like the metal part and the housing of this two movie two movie headline. It's really good, I would say that, you know, I like them so much. You know, the painting is really high class. Yep. It's not a cheap plastic. Yeah, I cannot say it's so it's super good. I would say yes. Alright, <clears throat> let's have a detailed look on this fantastic rover movie headline. Yep, like I said, this movie headline, the housing is exactly the same from the match movie headline. They come from the same housing metal factory. I would say that I like them very much. You know, you know when you look at the color and when you touch it, you will feel really comfortable. Yep. It's really high class, very good. And uh, you know, uh, this movie headline, you know, it is four line. Yeah, you know, it's four line LED. One, two, three, four. Yeah, four line LED, and each light has four LED. So totally, it is the sixteen LED, and each LED could be pixel mapping. Yeah, you know, each LED has its own channel. You know, just look at this moving headlight, you know. This is the plastic cover with the lens and all this side is the metal. It is metal, you know, uh, for the cooling part. Yeah, I would say this moving headlight will create a lot of heat. You know, and the base, you know, you look at the base, it's exactly the same as the match moving headlight. And the arms here is exactly the same as the match moving headlight. So I would say, yeah, judge from the housing, it's really good. I would say the Lux housing is really well built. But you know, when you look at the mirror here, look at the mirror here, you know, it's a really big mirror, a really big lens. Yeah, but you know, um, you could see here yeah, is a little bit, a little bit glue, a little bit glue alongside the lens. It's not, not really cool, but it's okay. You know, it, it's, it doesn't matter at all. You know, yeah, you could accept it. I would say that is yeah from the outside. I could say I like this movie can like, and yeah, you know, in the front here you can see there is the buttons and the. LCD display and the MS indicator and the arrow indicator. Yeah. And look at the side here, you know, uh, with the cream hole on both sides of the cream, cream hole here. Both sides got the cream hole. And look at the back side. You know, this is a big moving hand, it's not that uh, lightweight, you know, it weighs a little bit. And the back side here, you can see the DMS in, DMS out, power code in and power code out, and this is with the power switch. Yeah, this is it. And say, you know, in the back here, you can see the the whole body light clamp. Yep. Yeah. Alright, yeah, so far, you know, just judge from outside, I would say I like this moving head, you know, this looks really high class. I like spending, I like spill, and then. Uh, 
But I'm not sure how it performs when it's open it up and the, how the big effect. Okay. Yeah, let's get in power and check out its software. All right. All right, I'll get this moving headlight connecting with the power cord now getting on the switch. Yeah. Okay, so the system is setting and so it's adjusted with the trailer mode. Alright. And the so the driving mode version and the CPU temperature. You know, yep. Yeah. I would say, you know, it, it is really performance well on the setting. You know, yeah, it's safe, you know, you could still hear the, the the noise from fan, but it's not really big noise. You know, it could it could be okay. And you know, when it's on resetting, you did not hear any noise from the pan and tail moving. You did not hear any click 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 click. click. No, not at all. I would say you know it's really good on the resetting. I would say that super good. All right. And the fan is not that nice, you know. I would say, yeah, it's really good, really good. And you can see that the DMS indicator is perfection. That means it's not connected with the DMS. All right, let's get it. Check its software. Yeah, as you can see, you know, here says that no DMX. And the says that is channel 18, so it must be got zero. Channel well because it's a pixel mapping movie highlighting. Okay, it is automatic automatic power saving and get it address channel mode and no DMX. Get okay, so here's a setup, the set, information, menu control and advanced. You know, I'd say you know when you touch the the button here is really comfortable, you know, um, it's really soft. Yeah, so the button is really good, I like this button. You, you don't need to be really taking strength. You don't need to be, you know, uh, put it really hard, no. You know, you just click it, it's really soft. Yeah, and get into the setup. Okay, so, um, you know, when, when it's on the setup, <laughs> you could see the DMS address, you know, to enter to set the DMS address, okay, and get the DMS mode, so it is adding channel, adding and the 82 channel, 30 channel, and 18 channel, so it is 3 channel mode, alright, so the running mode, it is DMS, DMS and the sum mode, and the automatic mode and DMS mode, so three running mode and here is the pen yeah, pen in word pen in word and the tail in word and display yeah, change the direction of the display yeah, change the direction of the display right and the language setting and the automatic Automatic is it yes and no, yeah. So that sets, sets the automatic running and the DMFC error that means the clean the signal. Yeah. Alright. So we go back with the reset okay and with the information. The information display, yeah, it says that the display ball sub the reversion and the day and the tie right now and the temperature yeah it says that is the 30 degree yeah but it's dropping yeah around around 30 degree and let's go back and the xy driver 
Yeah, it, it is same also so the version and the time and the CPU temperature and the LED temperature. Yeah. And the LD1 driver, LD2 driver, LD3 driver, LD4 driver because you know there are four four light LEDs, so each light have one driver board. Yeah, it is a little bit complicated on this movie headlight to say that. Okay, it get to the manual control. So in the manual control, it is the uh, manual operating of moving headlight on each channel, you know, RGB and strobe dimmer and the XY and the stack, stack effect and the dynamic effect and the dynamic speed and micro effect. Yeah, that's it. Right, and the advance. So advance is for the updating of the wheel. We have seen many of these. Yeah, every moving headlight got the advance. Yeah, so the software is really simple. It's really simple, it's not complicated and the <coughs> and the display is really clean, I would say that. Okay. Yeah, let's go back. Alright, yeah, say as usual, we are going to plug in with the DMS controller and see if it's moving and see if it's dimming and see if it's colors and see if it's effects. Alright. Alright, I will get this movie and like connecting with the DMS controller, you know, my little controller is really helpful for me. And uh, <clears throat> you can see that the DMS indicator is on right right now, it's not on fraction, so it means that it's connected well with this signal. And you know, when I'm not operating the DMS controller, I could see here the fan is working, so it's not an intelligent fan, but you have to Consider that you know the movie headlight is pixel mapping, so inside the movie headlight, you got a lot of LEDs and you got a lot of motors. So, you know, the fan is really important for the cooling heat. So, it's normal when you hear the fan is working, and you can see that this is metal power which for the cooling system. All right, and um, all right, it says that the channel one is the pen. You know, I could say that you know the pen moving is not really fast. You know, it's just in the middle level. And when it's moving, you could hear a little sound from the motor, but not the bad. Not bad, I would say not bad. You know, I like it's moving. It's smooth. And the uh, channel 2 is pen by. Yeah. And channel 3 is the unlimited pen moving. You know when it's moving on the unlimited moving, it could hear a little bit, a little bit noise, but not not big, just very little bit noise. You know, just one. You know when it's moving, it comes across one part. It just have a little noise, really really little. And the channel four is the uh, tail. I would say the tail moving is fast, but you know, it seems that it's not very really powerful. Yeah, it looks like it's a little bit lazy when, when it starts. You know, when it starts, it's a little bit lazy, but when it's working, it's really fast. All right, so channel 5 is the tail bike. Yeah, just move very little. And channel 7, channel 6 is, and channel six is the Unlimited tail. Yeah, I have to say that you know when it's moving on the unlimited tail, you can see you know it is really powerful. Yeah, and it is really fast. Yeah, much faster when you're moving on the tail. No, not this. Right, this is tail. So you can see that you know it is a lot, like a little bit lazy when it start. When it starts, it's not a little bit lazy, but you know when it's moving on the no limited tail. You know, it's running really, really power. Yeah, I like that. I like this moving. I would say. And the channel 7 is the pen and tail speed. Okay. So it's not moving right now, so I'm going to speed a little bit fast. So it's moving fast. I should make it slow, so it's slow. Yeah, that's it. You know, it just, you know, control the speed of 
tail and the pad, but it, it did not control the the unlimited. Yeah, I put the unlimited moving arm on the trainer three and the trainer six. Wow! So you can see that you know when it's moving on unlimited, unlimited moving, it's really powerful. It's moving fast. I like this moving actually. You know, now I'm putting on the trainer seven, which controls speed. So there's no detection on this unlimited moving. So yeah. So it's, you see, it's nothing. All right. But you know you can see that when it's moving, it's really fast and it's not much noise, you know, it's, I would say that, you know, the moving on this moving light is also quiet. So, I, I'm thinking, you know, it's probably they come from the same housing factory as the match moving headlight. So, this two moving headlight when it's moving is really comfortable when it's, yeah, I would say that, yeah, they make you feel really comfortable, yeah. And the channel A is the dimmer, right? And channel 9 is the stroke, and channel 10 is the red. Alright, guess the off. And make it on the location on the channel um, channel 3. Right, so we can see that. No, no, not this, not this. Alright, make it a little. And the channel sex. Yeah, you see that. This is a back of May. Right, I really like it. But you know, when it's moving, on the uh, color is not moving. Alright, I put it moving up. Yeah. When it is get on the colors, you could hear the we. It's not that bad, but still could hear the wee. Yeah, it seems like it's from the sound from the electronic. You know, the the latch go through the PCB board or the LED, so it will create the sound of the wee. Yeah, that's that. That's the sounds like that, All right? So the channel, channel. 10 is the red, yeah, channel 11, 11 is green, yeah, say as the green, you know, because the electric, we, it's not very much still could hear it. We, you know, when it's doing the uh, show, when doing the DJ with, with the uh, loudspeaker, boom, push, 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 you may forget the we, but you know, when it's Working like this, you can hear the we. I don't know why. I don't know why. Yeah, I don't know if it could be improved. This is not really good, right? And the blue and the white, and you also can hear the we. Yeah, when I put all colors on, the the sound from the direction is a little bit louder. We. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. But when I put up the light, I could not hear any electric sound. Okay. I don't know if this moving light could be improved on this. You know, you hear that? Yeah, you hear that? Okay. And in channel 16 is the Channel 50 is dynamic back. Yeah, because you still, still hear the, the sound. Right, so make it move. Yeah, it's dynamic back. So when it's moving, I really like it's moving. You know, I could say you know, in the public model, it's moving, it's really good, super good. Right, and this the thing is not a dynamic back, and the um, no for voting is the dynamic back.
No, no, sporting is the static effect, right? Sporting is static effect. Yeah. And the fifth thing is dynamic effect. Okay, I'm putting sporting off. Get it off. Okay, no, no. Okay, get it off. Now, yeah, so sporting is dynamic effect. So you can see. This is dynamic back. No, it's static, yeah, yeah. So is static, this is static effect, right? You can see that the... Okay, I'm putting on the dynamic back on the channel 50. You can see the LED is moving, so this is the uh, dynamic, you know, when you're putting on the 41, the static, you know, the LED is not, not changing, not moving fast, all right? So this is difference. So this is the uh, dynamic on the channel 50. And the channel 60 is the speed control of the dynamic. Yeah, you can see it's running. It's running slow right now. Is it? Make it fast. We cannot see many difference. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, I made it stop. Maybe you can tell the difference. You can stop right now. Get the um, you know it's the LED is running. You get 16 on. All right, yes, it's running faster. Yes, yeah, running fast, fast, faster, faster. Running slow, 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 slow. Yeah, that's it. Okay. And the um, 17 is the macro effect. Check it out. Macro comes it. You can get it 50 off. No, get 50 off. Right, okay, the same is tested. It's the macro effect. And it doesn't see anything. Alright. Other one. Is that that is the other one? The macro, macro effect. The 50 to 99 is the um, other one more, 50. And this is it. It's not working. Alright, it's working right now. <laughs> yes, other one more on the... Other one the more one. Yeah. You know, here it got three other running mode, got three on the running mode on the channel 17 and the channel heading is reset. Yeah. You know when it's moving you could hear a little bit sound from the moving but it's not that bad. Basically I like it's moving as well as the maximum moving at like 25 LD. Yeah and also this I like it's moving. I would say that. But what I don't like is, you know, when it's working on the LED, you know, you can hear the sound from the electric. I don't know why, you know, it's a little bit, not really bad, just a little, but still not good. I don't know why. Alright, you get the other one off. Okay, this is the editing channel mode. Now I'm putting this movie here on the, um, on the, 30 channel mode, you know, it got 30 channel mode and 18 channel mode and also got the 82 channel mode, so it got 3 channel mode, what's the difference, you know? The 18 channel mode, you can see that the whole life works works together, you know, you could not control each LED or cannot, cannot control each line of the LED, but the 30, 30 channel mode, you could Control one of the LED, it's one light, two light, you could separate it, controlling. And the any two channel mode, you could control each LED separately. Alright, I'm going to put it on the 30 channel mode and show you how to control each light separately. Get it set, okay. The MS mode, okay. And get it on the 30, okay, alright. So it's now on the 30 channel mode right now, and um, 
It says that the channel 10 is the light one red. Alright, get on the channel 10. Get on channel 10. Yeah, you can see that the light one is on red. Okay, I get a little move. No, now this is the rotating, rotating. The tail pull, channel pull. You can see that only one light is on red, right? The other three lights is not on red, okay? Yeah, and, and the channel 11 is the light one on green. Light one on green, get it green, yeah. You can see that, also see that in channel 4, you know, this sort of one light is on green, the other light is not on green, yeah. Okay, so, this is red, blue, white, and the other light on red. Yeah, it's, it's next to the one. Yeah, it's next to. Alright, so I get one light one on the green, on red, alright? I get another on red, alright? This is two light on red right now, so you can see that on the rolling. Alright, this is light control separately. And also get the uh, night three on the red, so red, green, blue, white. So three light on red right now. Yeah, that's it. Okay, you see this drawing. One, two, three. Okay, this is now. Okay, three. All right, this is okay. One. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah, you see that? Three lights on the red right now. So this is the channel mode on um, 30, 30 channel mode. Each light we control separately. Okay, I'm getting it on to the um, 82 channel mode. That shows that each LED could be controlled separately. This is piece method. Right, get it, channel mode, Emax, 82, okay. All right, so now getting it in, in the 82. Why is on the setting? Right. Okay. Okay, and in, you know when it's on the 82 channel mode, the channel 80 is reset, so that is why it's on resetting, right? Yeah, you see that when it's reset, I have to say that it's really perfect on the moving. You know, you could not hear any more noise on the click, 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 right? So get it getting, getting up. Yeah, this is get it getting up. I'm get it getting up. And uh, red dim, channel 10 is red dim, get red up, now get red up and channel 11 is green dim, get green dim, and channel 14, yeah channel 14 is static effect so I get it up right now, okay, so um, you know accepting the pan tail and the no limited location, no limited moving on the pan and tail, you know. The editing to channel got the also got the whole demo on the red, green, blue. So you can see that the channel turn red, green, blue, white and the and static back and the dynamic back and the um, okay the the pistol map control start from the night 19 channel, right? Get it on 19, no. 17, 18, 19. Get it red. Okay, you can see one area is on red. And get it green, blue, white, yeah. Another area, yeah. So again, this first one on white. Another area, RGBW. What's that? Again, did it. Yeah, I'm sorry, you know, I just 
get it, did it so it did it all the <laughs> yeah, all the operations so I get it again. Okay. Okay, I, you know, you know when I get it delayed, you know, just click all my program. Yeah, click all the day, so I have to get the uh, demo on first on the channel and get it on. And the, uh, now getting the channel netting. Oh, yes, that's it. Right, you know, in the little controller, there is a delay here. You know, when that mistake click on delete, just delete all my date. God. Add green go wild. So I get another yet red green and the okay get go wild yet wild red green. So you can see that you know each LED could be has its own channel so this is a pixel mapping we have like you know that's it all right you know this moving headlights expects so for the uh roaring effect create a bit you know i don't have the buck here i don't have the hedge mushroom here so it probably could not see a really strong beam you know when it's with the buck you know, with the haze you could see a really strong beam now I'm getting the moving headlight on the automatic running mode and close the light and you can see it's back. You know, this is not a watch moving headlight, it's not a go moving headlight, just a that moving headlight with the location, with the effects. Alright, um, okay, I'm getting on the other one mode. Other one mode. On the um, channel 80. So I set it on a channel 80 mode, channel 80. Set channel mode. Channel 80. Yeah. You know, I'm not really good at the program, so if you're really good at the program, really good with the DMS controller, you know, you could make a lot of amazing effect on this big movie headline, you know, this effect movie headline. So, you know, this land normally, you know, um, if you use it as a DJ, you know, if your, the stage is not really big, so I don't think this moving and light is perfect for you. But it's hard to say, you know, it depends on the package, you know, this is not a really true moving and light, it's really expensive, I would say that. And, uh, you know, if you're doing the club or doing the decoration on the Disco on the party on the hotel, you know, just hang one light in the center of the stage. This is really, really good. I would say that you could see really good effect from it. All right. Okay, I'm getting it on the um, automatic running. So it's on the channel 70. Yeah. See the menu. Channel 17 micro effect. Yeah. Channel 17. On the uh, 15 to 99. Yeah, it's right now. So I'm going to close the light. So you can see that this moving headlight is unloading, or unloading right now, you know, it's this, uh, it is uh, uh, it's that moving headlight, you know. And though, even though you could not see the beam here because I do not carry the box or haze here, but you can see that it's a really good moving headlight, how would I say that? Yeah. So when it's on the strobing, but you know, I don't know why it could hear this sound from the we, you know, the electric, electric sound. God, I don't know why I get this, but it's not really big deal. It's not really big. You know, if the if you open the loudspeaker, you cannot hear it at all. 
Yeah, so this is automatic running mode. All right, this is the moving head. I would say that is really perfect. Okay. So you can see that it's running. Right, so I'm going to change another automatic running mode. Running automatic running mode. Yeah. I have to say that the moving of this moving headlight is not bad. It's yeah, I have to say that you know the moving on this moving headlight is not bad. It's really good. I like that actually. And uh, you know. This is another auto automatic running mode, but you know from my video you could not see any big difference from it. But you know if you, you are really good at the program, you know it could make a lot of amazing effect. Yeah. Okay. All right. This is it. You know we just test it, and um, every day I really I really like it. It's housing and you, you know if they don't open the slide you think it's a really high cost when we have light you know and when it's running it is smooth you know it, it would not cause a lot of noise like clean clean or would, would you know no you know it's moving really perfect and you know uh, what I don't like is you know when it's working on the LED you could hear the start from the electric when it go through the PCB board maybe I'm not sure which part of it but you know you could hear the we you know it's not that not that big but still it's not good so this is what it is upon me oh god but I would say that you know basically this is really good the bad we can like you know it's really good for the um, club or the party or the Anyway, you know, for the effects, yeah, you know, if you want to make some big effect, want some really cool big effect, this movie has like be a perfect choice, you know. And I would say that, yeah, again, I really like this painting, I like this housing, I like this cover. Yeah, it's really, really good. Yeah. All right, this is the video today, and uh, I really thank for all you guys watching me and watch my video all, all the time and click like. And uh, yeah, I really thank you for that. And if you think my video is okay, just you know, um, give me a like and also maybe go to my YouTube channel and subscribe the channel. So this is really helpful for me. All right, so all of my lives finished, and uh, maybe about. In Every day I will bring the auto packet or other lighting or to fill the video. Yeah, this is what I'm thinking. And so far, you know, I still many video on the we highlights, you know, there are some good, there are some really cool I like that. So also you know uh, if you want to see other videos, uh, just you know send me the pictures of the lights and I will try to find it out and get the video. Yeah. This is it. Again, I'm Lucas. Thanks for watching.